And I think uh, a lot of Americans sort of attach their own sense of morality to the whole story of Lincoln. And so I think that's one reason why I get attacked a lot <laughs> for trying to criticize certain things that Lingna has done. Who attacks you? Uh, well, I've had quite a few debates with uh, the academics uh, who have had careers in uh, sort of deifying Lincoln in their writings. And so uh, uh, I'm an economist and I'm used to a lot of back and forth debates and criticisms. For 20 years before I wrote the Lincoln book, I was an economics professor and I would go to, go to meetings, academic meetings, and that's what we do. We criticize each other and it's, it's usually constructive criticism. It's, it's not just showboating or trying to attack somebody, but then I found that the, this part of the history profession, when it comes to Lincoln, uh, you can criticize Thomas Jefferson, Bill Clinton, George W. Bush, Franklin Roosevelt, but you can't criticize uh, Lincoln, apparently, in the, in the history profession. And I thought that was very unscholarly and unprofessional and closed-minded uh, uh, of a sort of an attitude on the part of uh, some segments of, of the history profession, uh, which is a, a big part of the history profession. And so I see no reason why you can't take a look at, uh, at Lincoln just like you look at any other president and, uh, and look at the good, good and the bad, as far as that's concerned. And, uh, and there's plenty of bad. You know, what Lincoln's suspension of habeas corpus and the mass arrest of tens of thousands of northern civilians and his shutting down of hundreds of uh, opposition newspapers. These are things that most Americans never heard of. Uh, when I'm giving public speeches about this, um, people are uh, dumbfounded. They, they accuse me of being a liar <laughs> because they were never taught this in school. And of course, it's all well documented. It's not, uh, it's not a secret, but it's just one of these things that uh, the historians know about all of this. But the average American doesn't seem to, to know, uh, unless he reads my books, I guess, and, and, uh, and the books of a few others. Sitting by my window looking out Them old gray clouds coming round My lady sitting by my side As the rain starts pouring 